Hey, sweet loves. Welcome back to Sweets Unmuted. I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you guys are having a blessed day. Um, to my new subscribers, thank you for joining my sweet love soul tribe. To my returning subscribers, I definitely appreciate your love and your loyalty. So, yeah, we gonna go right in and get right into it, sweet loves. I'm out here today at the cemetery. I came to visit kid's father he's been pulling on my energy heavy so I figured I'd sit and have a moment with him and do a read so we're gonna see what's the tea from the kipper deck we're gonna be reading from the kipper and from the what's tea deck today and as I was shuffling I don't know if you guys seen it oh well another one one slipped out so we got poverty okay so someone that you left out in the cold what about this person spirit I'm sorry, sweet loves. I didn't even do my prayer. <laughs> Holy Spirit, I surrender my mind, body, and spirit to you, dear God. Use me as a vessel for the messages that you would like to be conveyed to my sweet loves. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. And he's sitting right there, the good father, probably like, uh-uh, girl, what you got going on? Y'all want to see him? I don't know if y'all can see But yeah, he up here. What else do we have? So you guys left someone out in the cold. Could have been someone you were, just could have been your main man staying, okay? Someone you were in a connection with. Yep, definitely someone you were in a connection with. So someone's feeling left out in the cold, you could have actually left this person out in the cold. They, oh, we got great fortune at the bottom. Whoever this person is, they could want a new beginning with you. They could also see you in high honor. Could be trying to travel towards you to give you a gift. So they're definitely going to try to travel towards you because I was shuffling the scene travel. And right here I have the, what's T deck? And the cards have flipped over. And right here I have this, travel. I got travel and also have lonely. So with that and someone with lonely and travel that's double confirmation and you also heard the horn blow um someone you left out in the cold is considering coming towards you because they feel left out in the cold they're lonely anything else spirit you probably end up getting into the world truth with this what else do you have yeah they're in deep concern they're in deep concern you could have seen this person in high honor at one point um they could have walked around and portrayed themselves as an official person or like they, you know, really wanted to commit with you, possibly marry you or want to be in a committed connection with you. Um, but something took place. Something took place and they're in deep regret. Could be doing a lot of reflecting. They're feeling left out in the cold and lonely. Um, they're wanting a new beginning. You could have a child with this person. Um, they definitely see you in high honor, which is why they could be in such uh, concern. They could have came to you towards you trying to give you an offer and you rejected it. You guys could definitely have children together. So whoever this person is, they're watching you. They're creeping, spying, watching what you got going on. Um, they could could have had you in competition with other men or women, but someone lost their chance. Either you did or they did. But yes, yeah, someone's definitely been left out in the cold. And they want you back. Whoever this person is, they have a lot of bad habits. They could suffer with addictions, drinking addictions, drug addictions just different toxicities that don't align with you, you know, and they could even be experiencing legal issues at this time. Whoever this person is, they could have came towards you or gotten a connection with you for stability. This could be their MO. They could go into connections for money or for stability. You could have left this person out in the cold and just been working on yourself 
Yep, once you back, double confirmation because that came out. Once you back, they're deep. They stole your time, your money, your energy. You know, this person could have took you through a lot emotionally. They could have been very emotionally manipulative um, and just robbed you of the things that you truly deserve. So let's get a little more truth on this situation. See what we got going on here. I hope y'all having a good day and a blessed day, sweet loves. Oh, yeah, whoever this is, you done. I think fuck you, you done. <laughs> they want you back. You said fuck you, you done. All right, so whatever happened, whatever happened with this situation, Spirit is saying chill out. This is a part of his plan. So whatever has this person in concern or if you're in concern is well deep thought spirit spirit says this is a part of his plan we said think about life when you were with them versus how life is for you now okay and then we have sleeping with your man so you could have found out that somebody slept with your man but spirit says chill out this is part of the plan right and he wants you to think and reassess how your life was when you were with them versus how your life is now, okay? Uh, I'm gonna have to go get that. Oh, uh, yep, yeah, you're fed up. You could be fed up. Whatever you found out can have you just fed up with the situation and you over it but spirit is saying chill out this is a part of his plan okay trust his direction a lot of times he know what we need before we even need it if he exposes something something to us we got to understand that he tells us the truth for what reason not to hurt us but to help us see the truth in the situation so we just got to trust in his plan that's all Trust in this plan. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Okay. So, I hear that, right? Confirmation. So, yeah. Confirmation. This person is going to come towards you and try to give you an offer. They could literally be in prison or incarcer incarcerated. Or they're in a mental in prison. Gives, this car, honestly, in this moment, gives me mental in prison, imprisonment. This person is currently in mental imprisonment. Why? Confirmation. Because they were a wolf in sheep's clothing, okay? They were wolf in sheep's clothing. They portrayed to be someone that they weren't, you know? They came off as if they were this official person and could be seen in high honor. And the whole time, they were a wolf in sheep clothing. And now they're coming your way, trying to give you an offer. And guess what? You're not uninterested. Why? Because you just fed up with this person's bullshit. And that's okay. No one to walk away. All right? No one to walk away. No one to walk away. It doesn't serve you. It doesn't make you happy. Listen. <laughs> oh, toodles. All right. Chuck up the deuces. All that bullshit for the birds. You ain't nothing but a vulture. Ah, ah, ah. Always hoping for the worst. Waiting for me to fuck up. You regret the day when I find another girl. Yeah. Or maybe this could be for, for one of you masculines because the song says you'll regret the day that I find another girl. You feel me? So, yeah. Y'all know my, y'all know, y'all know Sweets had to get a little singing in there. Y'all know I wasn't going to let y'all get off without getting a little sound of my voice. <laughs> but, yeah, that's all I have for you right now, sweet loves. I love you guys. Love and light to you all. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click the post notification bell so that you are notified each and every time I upload a new video and each and every time I go live. Love and light to you all.